Hey everyone, today I am sharing with you the secret to instantly look slimmer, one easy step, and at least in my case, it also grows my self-confidence, makes me feel taller, more confident, and more comfortable in my clothes. And the secret is shapewear, and not just any shapewear. I think all women at a certain point have tried all kinds of shapewear, all different brands, all different types, and today I have finally found the brand that absolutely works for me in so many ways, and that brand is Honey Love. This video is sponsored in collaboration with Honey Love, and I am so excited to share with you all the discoveries that I have made and how you can instantly look slimmer by putting on one or more of the pieces I'm about to share with you. I'm also gonna share with you quite a few outfits that are perfect as we move from summer into fall. These are great transition pieces, so be sure to check the description box below. I have a link that if you click on that, will get you 10% off your order at Honey Love. I've listed all the specific pieces from Honey Love that we're gonna talk about today, and I also went ahead and listed all the outfit pieces that I am wearing if any of these things are interesting to you. Also, sizing note, I got a size small in every single Honey Love piece that I am sharing with you today, if that helps you gauge what size you might be. So let's start with bodysuits. I have two to share with you. The first one is the tank bodysuit. It retails for $109, and it comes in sizes extra small to 3X, and is available in four colors. Like I said, I'm wearing it in size small. So lots of things to share with this one and the next one, they have very similar features. First of all, I love the compression. It is specifically designed to give you really nice compression along the stomach, lifts up the rear end, holds all the things in, lifts all the things up. The straps do not dig into your skin. They are wider straps, but they blend seamlessly into your shoulders. There's no back fat, there's no bulging. Also really nice is you don't need to wear a bra with these. It has built-in support, underwire free, no wires, lifts everybody up, does have removable pads, here I'm wearing actually the cami version that we're gonna talk about in a minute. Almost identical features in both of them. Really the only difference is that the straps are adjustable and thinner on the cami version, but here I am wearing the removable pads. They are in fact not removed. I just felt a little more comfortable with a white cami to have those pads in for modesty, but you can see they push everything up just a little bit more. If you want a little less coverage, a little less support, pull the pads out, it's entirely up to you. And while of course these are technically shapewear, and when you think shapewear, you think hidden under clothes, and you can certainly wear them that way, these pieces are all designed to also be seen if you so choose. So I took the tank bodysuit and I kinda dressed it up for date night. So I think this is especially nice to wear as we're transitioning into fall and we're putting on jeans, maybe some of us putting on jeans for the first time in a really long time. It helps with that confidence level, especially with skinny jeans, to have a little extra compression and lift. So I'm really glad that I'm wearing that bodysuit here. Just paired it with my go-to pair of skinny jeans, a little distressing, I think is a little sexier for date night, but that's just me. You could certainly wear this outfit with just the bodysuit jeans, pair of shoes, you're good to go. I did decide to throw actually another version of this shirt. This is the uh, Rails Hunter shirt, the one you're seeing, and the try-on is their camo version. It's a nice, silky, kind of lightweight, flowy, drapey top. And just to dress it up a little bit more, instead of my usual closed-toed booties, I picked these sort of open, cut-out side booties. I just got them recently from Nordstrom. It's a casual date night look, but I ran it by my husband and he approved of it for date night, so I just wanted to share that with you. If you want to dress it down a little bit, you know, keep the shirt on, button it a little bit, swap it out for closed-toed booties, sneakers, you have an entirely different look, same piece. I did want to point out some neat features that you can't really see in the try-on. First of all, I'm sure you're aware of what it looks like, these mesh see-through panels. Here's the one I had on. I've turned it inside out. It's actually a nude lining, so you're totally covered. There's no actual skin showing here. It just has a very light mesh, black color or whatever color of the bodysuit that you pick over it. So it gives the illusion of a nude panel, but it is in fact, you are completely covered 
There's nothing showing, so I really like that feature. Something else for those of you that are long torsoed, you're gonna like, it has a very adjustable gusset. If you're not aware of what the gusset is, it is the part that goes on the bottom. It is the crotch, let's just call it what it is. And what's nice is it has hook and eye closures here, and you can adjust how short or long you want it, which gives you more room in the torso, which I think is fantastic. I mean, it's quite a range here, from here to here in hooks. That's a, that's a lot of length difference. Now let's talk about its sister bodysuit. This is the cami bodysuit. As you can tell, the main difference, of course, is the straps. They are thin, they are adjustable. There is a price difference. This is $99, comes in sizes extra small through 3X, no, 4X, sorry. And it comes in five colors. Same benefits as the tank, very similar features. These straps do not dig into my shoulders at all either. Same kind of lift, compression, smoothing, all those benefits. Both bodysuits have a nice full brief bottom. It does not ride up. We all have tried shapewear bodysuits, or just regular bodysuits. We all tried them, and every single one of us, at some point admitted, has, during the course of wearing one, had to look around and find a discreet way to tug it out from your rear end. It's happened to all of us. I have been wearing this one for hours. I have not had to adjust it. I have not had to touch it. It is comfortable. I have no idea what magic is in this. It is outstanding. So I showed you previously how you could wear these bodysuits out and about like this and the tank earlier for a date night, but obviously this is shapewear and you can choose to wear it underneath clothes as well to give you a little more confidence, feel a little smoother, whatever it is the reason why you choose to wear shapewear. And in this case, it worked out perfectly for me. So I have this in black as well and I just recently ordered a two-piece set from Amazon, got it in a size small and it fit but I just felt like it was a little snug. The medium is gonna to be too big. I really loved this outfit. And on top of it, it is a crop top. And I was a little worried, well, what happens if I lift my hands up? Is everything gonna fall out? Well, luckily, no, it is paired with high-waist pants. But I took this cami bodysuit in black and put it on underneath. And magically, the outfit fit like perfect. Action. Everything was smooth. This is the kind of fabric that's going to show every lump, every bump. I'm not talking about the bodysuit. I'm talking about the two-piece set. And this just smoothed everything. No panty lines visible. I didn't need to wear a bra because I had the lifting feature of the built-in bust support. And this outfit, by the way, is outstanding. I just chose black because I felt like it was the most versatile option. You could wear it in a variety of environments. You could throw a blazer over it wear it to a conservative work environment, pair it with some basic black pumps. It's a really great piece, but what makes it that much better is the shapewear under it. I should also add that I noticed after wearing both of these many times, this was the first piece of shapewear that I could get into and out of without laying on the floor, laying on the bed, tugging everything on, you know what I'm talking about. And also, easily, I could take it off, and after having worn it for hours, there were no lines like digging into my skin. You know exactly what I'm talking about. After you've taken off other shapewear, and you have like the straps are digging in, and the whatever compression things are in here, sucking everything in, leaves those dents in your skin. None of that. I have no idea how this works, but I am in love. Okay, let's get to the next piece. That is their lift wear tank. And I love this because it comes in so many colors. Definitely meant to be worn to be seen. Nine colors, $84. Comes in sizes extra small to 3X. So you have two strap options. You have the wide strap, just like the tank bodysuit, and then you have the cami option as well. I only got it in the wide strap version. Similar to the cami and that the straps don't dig into the skin. There is that built-in bus support, no wires, very, very comfortable, it gives great cleavage. I will say, I, I read on their website, if you choose the cami option, you can take, unhook the straps, cross them in the back, it gives you a little more support in the bust if that's something that you need. Also has the removable pads, really smooths the tummy and the sides. You're not gonna see love handles, muffin top, or any of that. And there's something about that very bottom of the hem that makes it so it doesn't ride up. You don't have to keep adjusting it. You just put it on, you can tuck it in or place the shirt where you want it, the tank where you want it, 
and it doesn't move, which I really enjoy. You can wear it as a base layer or some sort of shapewear to smooth underneath something if you want, but because it comes in so many pretty colors, you can certainly wear it out like a regular tank, which I have many times. I do have some fit and sizing tips for the tank. First of all, do not try to pull it over your head. It's best if you step into it and pull it up and kind of put the girls where you want them to be. If you're between sizes or you want more stomach compression, you should size down. If you want it to be a longer length in the shirt or you have wider hips, then you should size up. I just went with my true size small and it seems to be working just fine. I should touch on this look that I'm sharing is almost identical to the look I wore recently and to attest as to how comfortable these tanks are, I wore this on the road trip home from Oxford, Mississippi, wore it for about eight, nine hours all the way to Houston, went out to dinner in this outfit, very, very comfortable, felt great in it, and it was, I thought, nice enough to go out in. Very similar to the date night outfit, I paired it with some wider leg, actually I think they're straight leg linen pants, and I wanted to share this idea with you. When you're wearing more voluminous clothing on the bottom, you definitely want something that's tighter fit on top just to balance it out. So I like pairing the tank with the looser fit pants. Again, if you want a little more coverage or if you're going in and out of AC, throw a lightweight top over it. I did that on my road trip. It's just a versatile piece. I mean, it's essentially, it's a tank top. And so you can wear how you would wear any tank top that you have in your closet, except this one has built-in benefits. Now the last piece that we are gonna talk about, I think if I had to pick a favorite and it's tough, it's gotta be these. They're the 2.0 leggings. They just come in this beautiful pure black color. They are $119 and come in sizes extra small to 3X. And when I say a pure black, it is squat proof, not see-through, just a perfect black color. It has hidden shaping panels to shape and smooth the tummy, lift the rear end. Everything is just perfectly shaped. It has a high waistband, so there's no muffin top, no love handles to worry about. I love the pocket placement on these. So many of these leggings with pockets, whether they're shapewear or just standard leggings, they, I feel like they put the pockets too low and they're sitting right on the widest part of your hip and they're not deep enough to really put anything of significance in them. These pockets, the opening is placed right at the top of your hip, which I think is beautiful and they're really deep. I mean, I can get almost half my arm in there. I don't know what you're putting in your leggings, but you can put pretty much anything you want in them with those pockets. They are also designed not to be worn with underwear. Yes, you heard me right. You can go commando in these and not need to worry about anything showing that shouldn't be showing if you know where I'm going with this. The only sizing tip that I have for you is if you're in between sizes to size down, but I stayed with my true size small and we've all tried, I think at this point, some version of shapewear leggings and they're all very similar and that you basically have to hide in a dark room to put them on because it is humiliating as you're tugging and pulling and rolling and trying to get all the things. You just step into them and pull them up. That is so nice. And there's no sagging, there's no bagging, they're not too long, they're not too short. I am in love with them. And I wanted to show you how versatile they are, so I've paired them a few ways. First is, you absolutely could wear these to work out. They're squat proof, they're not see-through. I like the fact that you don't have to wear underwear with them, so it's just one less layer of sweating. It does absorb sweat, so you don't need to worry about sweat showing through. I just paired it with one of the liftwear tanks and my go-to workout sneakers, but then you can take it to the next level and wear it as actual like, clothing. And I wanted to share this because I've had this blazer for a while. I'm gonna link a very similar one, and I never really wore it because I didn't know what to wear it with. I didn't know how to really put it over skinny jeans, if it was too bulky works great over these leggings. And I picked one of the liftwear tops to share with you this beautiful sort of mulberry plum color. It's perfect for fall as we transition into, fingers crossed, cooler weather soon. Brings out sort of the plaid houndstooth. Is it houndstooth? It's plaid of blazer. I love the look. This could be a fun date night look too, as my husband pointed out as we were filming this. And then lastly, my sort of go-to look for winter, for getting ahead of ourselves, throw a tunic sweater over it, get some nice high boots, and you have an entirely different look. Three different ways of wearing the same pair of leggings. I cannot stress to you how much I love this shapewear. It just makes me feel more confident when I have it on. It's opening up more wardrobe choices to me as well. And I haven't even tried their bras and panties yet, which are next on my list. So if you want to try any of these pieces, don't forget you have to use the link that's down in the description box. And when you do that, it automatically applies 10% off your order, which is really nice. 
Like I said earlier, I have everything listed down in the description box, sizing, pricing, all the things. Please let me know if you have any questions about any of the stuff that I shared today. Thanks for hanging out with me and I'll see you in the next one.